Well, hello again. This is a dragon hat. I uh, have to thank uh, about three people for the inspiration on this, for sure. I think the first uh, person is Dave of Balloon One Twister. He definitely kind of got me thinking about this on one of his videos. Uh, I think uh, Mark Byrne kind of also on the, 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 the wings. Um, and the, the mouth or the head here came from uh, the Balloon Buffoon. Check him out. He's got some interesting stuff. Um, anyway, it uses uh, one, two, three, four, six balloons and a scrap of yellow. Depends on how detailed you want it to get with this. And of course, it, you know, it can be a hat. It doesn't have to be. Of course, it go like that. So anyway, I always uh, start this one with the head. So I'm just going to grab random colors out of my bag. And we're going to do the head part. And we start with uh, about that much for the uninflated. And we're going to do the, the mouth. Uh, there. We've got about a three inch, maybe one and a half, two inch. Of course, we've got the pinch twists. And we come back and uh, line that up a bit better. There we go. That will be the, the, the mouth area. Now we'll do the eyes. And that's pinch, a couple of two inch bubbles. Two more two inch bubbles. And then we're going to do the mouth, or the, bo the bottom of the jaw. Just a big full okay. Of course, you can you can do this section any way you want, any way that that gets you to this. Now we'll grab um. Well, we'll we'll grab a white. About uh, five inches, maybe. Try that. Slight squeeze. Tie the other end there, and right in the middle, there. and that gets put into the eyes. Go into the back of the head. Spin that over. This extra holding it in tight. Wrap it around. The exact same thing here. Hold it in tight. Wrap it around, and you can get rid of this. And we can, whoops, get rid of this. There. So that is the head of the dragon, just like that. Good, we'll put that down. Then we'll grab, um, what the heck, we'll grab a couple of gray balloons. Okay? And we'll blow those up all the way. And slightly soften. There we go. Tie them. Check the head size. There. Wrap one through. That locks it in place right to the end. We grab a little bubble right there on each end. Now we're going to do the wings. So we go about, about halfway. Make our bend. And And we'll do it again right here. Put oops, as many folds in there as you think you need, okay? If you want more, put more in it, you know, right, uh, right here. There. I did that wrong, but anyway, you do it better than me, okay? There, that, that'll do for now. Grab our dragon head, tie it on. Now when I'm doing um, birthday parties or, or restaurants, I usually leave it like that. I put one of the bubbles at the back here, it keeps the wings flared out. And we put the head right there, and we put our eyes on, which are just one line down, like that. I usually leave it like that, okay? 
Now, if I've got time, and depending on where I am, I will either put a tail on, and here's the tail. Uh, if I don't, if, if I'm in a restaurant, I don't want the child to have a long tail sticking backwards, so then I put the fire on. But if I'm at a birthday party, I will put the tail on. And that's if I have the time. And sometimes I don't. So, like I said, they just get it the way I made it. Anyway, we're going to do a series of bubbles. This will kind of be almost like the spine going down the dragon's neck. There. And then we do our tail. It goes over the hat. Wrapping that in, shaping it a little bit, and there's the dragon. Now, if you want to put, if you'd like to put the fire in there, then we'll grab whatever you think are fire colors. For right now, we'll do uh, orange and yellow, and we'll blow those up. We don't have to blow them up all the way, of course, and we tie them together. And then we wrap them around. Don't go too far, otherwise the kid will be smacking everybody not meaning to. Okay. Yeah. Get rid of that. Get rid of this. And put the ties in into the dragon mouth. There. There, we have our dragon with fire. Uh, if you want to add more things, this is just if you do, actually let's get a different color. We will get a red this time. We'll put some teeth on there. Once again, that's totally uh, if you've got a whole bunch of time. Okay, So we're going to make one little tooth. And then we're going to squeeze the air out of this balloon. Wrap it around. And another little tooth right there. Get rid of that. Tie, of course. Either use your scissors or you just pull it off. Scissors are much cleaner, but anyway, for now, we're just going to use our fingers. So, there is, you know, um, you could add a fancy tail. We're not going to do that today. Anyway, I hope you like this dragon, and I sure appreciate the people whose um, ideas I have modified for it. So, uh, to those three people, or perhaps more that I don't remember, thank you very much.